Hello, everyone. RPG Kingdom Kid here, back with some more Yakuza Like a Dragon. In the previous video, we went around Kamurocho. Uh, not Kamurocho, Jesus. It's going to be a while for me to remember that this isn't Kamurocho, but uh, yeah. Uh, I changed the settings on a few things of the videos here. Uh, my I boosted up the frame per seconds up to 30. I hope that's not too much, so I'm probably not going to record that much today. For this, I'll probably just record one part. I also changed another thing, too, so... Uh, this is basically kind of a test. I was like, let's see if I can make it look a little bit better, so... But anyway, it looks like we got a business that we're now going to incorporate, so let's, uh... Let's do this. I'm ready to start your training whenever you are. What do you think? Let's do yeah, it. Let's do it. All right, then. Thanks, Kazuga. Here we go. Say, that's the wise thing to do. Alrighty, like I said, I think this is going to be somewhat similar to the, uh, the real estate business. Uh, the real estate business. Uh, the real estate business minigame thing that was in Yakuza 0. That's what I'm, I have a feeling is going to be somewhat similar to that in a way. This is a business management simulator in which Kazuga takes on the role of a company president in order to bring Ichiban conf Confection straight to the top. Move my stuff a little closer here. If you want to become the best company in Yokohama, you'll have to reach the number one spot in the share prize ranking. Management is played out in two phases, day-to-day -day business and shareholder means. Kazuga will run the business a total of four times and give a financial report at the shareholder meeting at the end of each period. In giving... And keeping with good business practice, Kazuka cannot use company funds as his personal piggy bank, nor can he use any of his personal funds to fund the company. Ah! Ah, that kind of blows. Because I was thinking, like, okay, this is going to be a good way for us to make money, but no. Maybe, maybe at first that's the case. They say one of the best ways to boost profits is boost sales. And let's try running the business once to get a feel for how management works. We got a job to do. Okay. The employees are very motivated. <laughs> Please put the shrinkage. Shikatanai no. Overstock. <laughs> business concluded. Here's how the business did. These results are kind of underwhelming. Oh, we're kind of bleeding money here. Okay. Those are tanking. Sales price dropped. Yeah. It dropped. Our ranking dropped. Not by much, but yeah, it dropped. Okay. And that's about all there is to managing a business. So? Not too hard, is it? Yeah, not so bad. Uh, yo. Wait up. You're acting like this is in the back, but we're flat broke. Broke as hell. Broke as uh, hell. You didn't have to put it like that. Right now, all we have on staff is a bunch of deadbeats. And don't even get me started on the furniture and equipment. Of course we're in the red. 
So what can we do? We'll have to invest. Uh, we need to advertise, hire competent staff, get new equipment, maybe some new furniture while we're at it. And we're gonna pay for all that how? Uh, good question. Then what the hell do we do? That's where you come in. Seriously? What kind of mess did I get myself into? All right, well, first <laughs> off, let's think about how we'll get the money to cover the infrastructure and new hires. I don't know if anyone would be willing to invest in us. I suppose we'll have to take out another loan? Uh, and after Nonomiya-san just repaid the last one, too. Would you know anybody? Who, someone with money? Or a rich friend? Or maybe someone from your childhood who grew up to be an oil baron? <laughs> Look, I'm unemployed and ex-Yakuza. Why would I have... Wait. Hmm? What is it? No. He wouldn't, would he? Who? That's where I'm at. Come on, Nick. I want to do this. Ah, the company Nick. No uh... son's sake. I just need a little bit of financing. I think it's called. Please, it's the man, dude you helped him with the cell phone. Uh. Mm. <laughs> you okay there, Nick? Excellent! Your kindness and consideration for others is truly moving! Come <laughs> impressed! Downright emotional! Consider it done! Uh, thanks, Nick. I'd be thrilled to invest in your company. <laughs> really? Man, thanks, Nick! That said, I'm no novice when it comes to management. I can't just throw money at you like it's nothing. If you want the funds, you have to meet my three conditions. The conditions? Indeed. If you can agree to them, consider the investment yours. Seriously? Okay, yeah, man, whatever it takes. So, what are these conditions? Yeah, let's hear them. First condition, the company must never be in the red. Now, I don't ever want to see a minus next to company funds. And that includes the starting capital I'm about to give you. If I do, I'll have arrangements made to counter this on mine. This is by no means free money, and I am not a charity. Sound good so far? Yeah, that's fine. Very well. Second condition. I want the company's share price ranking to be within Yokohama's top 100 by the specified deadline. Share what now? Ranking. It's what measures the company's value. If the share price goes up, so does the ranking. And I want your company to be in the top 100. Knowing you and your company's potential, it should be a piece of cake. So the mm -hmm. deadline is simply there to keep you. Hey, that one might be a little hard because we're starting at 151. Deadline. Condition two suits you fine? Yeah. Well, what's condition three? The last condition. And you can take all the time you need with this one. I want you to become the number one company in the share price ranking. Best of the best, huh? I want that little ah. confectionery of yours to be the crown jewel of your. I wonder if that's like how oh god Nick Ogata ties into this top. game or this I'm story is through this bit. I'm not going to anyone who can't fulfill these conditions. So, what'll it be? You got yourself a deal. I don't fully understand it, but I'm gonna do my best. I'll see to it that Ichiban Confections becomes the biggest company in Yokohama. Then we're on the same page. Okay. With that, I'll go get the first portion of the investment ready for you. You're free to use the money for whatever you like, be that improving infrastructure or personnel logistics and training. Awesome. Thanks a bunch, Nick. No need to thank me. I'm expecting some kind of return. Okay. Before, so it, it's going to be somewhat similar, I think, but it's a little different because unlike the one in Yakuza Zero, you actually got to use that money, and it was basically like all. Once you beat the five millionaires or six billionaires, whatever they were called, and you bought all the businesses and you had like the best employees you can, it was like it was a snap of the button. You just like walk away and then the money just kept rolling in. Like that's that and the cabaret club that Majima did, the best way to get money in that game. And then of course once you're able to beat Mr. Shakedown, he, that's obviously a good way too. Because boy, how you get a shit ton of money from that. Um. But I have a feeling like this this won't tie at all to the story. This is more like a, a, a side story. Uh, 
type thing. So I, I could probably completely ignore this as soon as I'm done with this, and I'll probably be fine. That being said, I don't plan on ignoring it. So. company is good and stable. Looking forward to the results. Well, adios. Just look at all this money! Wow, boyfriend, you actually wow, boy, did it! Wow, boyfriend. I'd be all over you if I was younger. <laughs> Gee, thanks, lady. I'll take that as a compliment. This is amazing. Thank you, Kasuga-san. Very cute. Save your thanks for Nick Ogata. Besides, it's not like this came with no strings attached. There are conditions. No dropping into the red, be in the top 100 share price ranking by the specified deadline, and ultimately take the top rank in share price. These are his conditions? Yeah. yeah. And I'm not about to disappoint them. I think if I get... I, mean, I, I might just do this until I get into the top, top 100, 100, so... Hmm. That's gonna be tough. So we'll have to make sure we do our very best. Well, let's start by using this money to get this company back on its feet again. Kasuga-san, just let me know when you're ready to begin. You got it. Receive 5 million yen in support from Nick Ogata. Nick Ogata's conditions rank within 5 business periods, okay? Reach top 100 within 5 business periods, okay? Could I leave now if I wanted to? I cannot. Okay, so I'm still in this, which is fine. It's fine. I think it's about time we put Nick Sun's money to use and start rebuilding this company. What do you think? Yeah, let's yeah. do it. Then without further ado, I, mean, I can't leave. Let's so. begin. Maybe at some point they'll be like, okay, now you can start using this money, but we'll see. Kazuka Sun, I think it'd be wise to maximize Nick Sun's investments by reviewing the current state of the company. Let's start by checking on Ichiban Confections. Go to properties and check the details of your properties. Now, properties allow you to buy or sell properties as well as improve those owned. But right now, I feel we should focus on signing our employees. As it turns out, I'm not too sure about what will work best for us. kazuga san I'll leave a review of the assigned employees to you. Go to Assign to change employees assignment to your properties. Select the sign, then Ichiban Confections. Each property has ability requirements that affect products. If your pro products, services, and reputation are not up to par, you may face difficulties in your business like diminishing sales and unforeseen issues. Make sure to stay above these projection services and reputation requirements by switching around your assigned employees. Charismatic, everything but about him is a little lower. Reach services if we if I replaced. Okay, and we'd actually be better with this. Oh, right, 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 right. Nicely done, Kazuka son. Employees are assigned and ready to go. Continuing on, please check the employees assigned to each one confections. Go to employees to check details of employees, select employees and employee list. 
Dr. Fetch Paterno has five employees, but to be honest, the wages we're paying out are on the biggest de determines it to our profits. It's going to sound terrible, but laying off two of these employees might be necessary to get us back on track. Kisika Sun, please lay off two employees who are not currently assigned to a property. The wages of employees who are not assigned to a property are paid in the form of surplus labor costs, which are deducted from sales. Try to avoid risking your business by laying off these employees when conditions are not satisfactory. Okay. Great, we should start seeing some improvement from here on. All that's left now is to see where the dice fall. You can also strengthen the properties from the manage properties menu. How you handle that is up to you, kazuki -san. Okay, kazuki -san, if you're all set, then let's get down to business. Well, if I do that, I won't be get able to get the services. Invest in service, necessary expenditure. There we go. We got a job to do. Okay, so I basically, I get this is like, the way that it works is that this is the way that we will get. Let's make that again. Like, the red is like where we need, to, like, if we don't get past that red, we'll always be in the red. But if we pass it, then we'll get a, a profit. Okay. Pretty lucky. Nice, I think that was a little more than what was projected. These are incredible results. Nice, you guys did great out there. Here's a going up. That's the good shit. Our ranking went up. Ah, uh, ranking only went up by one, huh? Oh boy, that's gonna be- that's gonna take a while. Maybe I have to do this first bit first before they'll let me continue on with the story. Let's get, uh, past the 100. Hell yeah! We actually made a profit! Amazing! We did it! And all thanks to Nixon's investment. Having an investor makes all the difference, it seems. It just goes to show the importance of where you put your money. Right. To invest in people or infrastructure. There are so many ways to do this right here and now. But we should also consider how the money can be used in the future. Money for the future? I guess it all boils down to making the right choice at the right time. There's more to this than I thought. That's true. I'd say we're on the right track, seeing as we made a profit this time. Ichiban Confections is finally making a comeback. Been here Let's for years. Let's continue working Walking our way years, into the top 100, years. Kasuga san. Uh, President Kasuga. You know it. <laughs> Can never lay off an omelet. Yes, I knew it. Fuck yeah. Okay, now I could probably leave if I want to, right? Yes, I could leave. I don't want to yet. Let's continue on with this. Or not? Can I not continue with this? Is this something that I can... Or... Maybe I, maybe I need to leave first, then I can come back. Hell of a day. 
You said it. Uh, and we've got our gig at the Yokohama Trading Company tomorrow. Again. Again. Guess we should just head back and hit the hay. Yeah, it's not healthy to stay up too late. Who are you, the sleep police? I'll go to bed when I'm ready. Come on, we're buddies now. So trust me, you need your beauty sleep. <laughs> I love how she shit talks she Naba. Have a thing for me, does she? You ever notice how she only picks on me? Maybe that's what she does to men she's secretly attracted to. <laughs> Not a chance in hell, old boy. Hey, how about I make dinner for everyone? Wow, you can cook? Like a chef. I'll just go buy some ingredients. Nanchan, come with me and carry the bags. Nanchan? Here we go. <laughs> oh, poor fool. Well, maybe she does have a thing for him. She sure seems happy about falling in with us. But... But what? I wonder if it's really the best thing for her, you know? I guess it is a dangerous bridge she's crossing with us. But it's what she wants. Just because she's having a little fun with it doesn't mean she ain't committed. Shouldn't we respect that? Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Okay, be back in two shakes. Two shakes of what? <laughs> okay. Can I... I actually want to go back to the business and kind of like work on that a little bit. We sure went hard last night, huh? <laughs> it was a nice change of pace. Yeah. Guess we should head to the warehouse. What's up? We gotta get to the bottom of this shady stuff quick. Can't have much more of it. Wanna see my CD collection? Okay, Shay Shay. Next? Let's see. One million yuan. Just a minute. No, there's not enough. Excuse me, boss? What is it? There isn't enough money in the safe. Huh? Oh, well, we have had a lot of shipments lately. What? Chicago 喂,這個是什麼東西? 不好意思,讓你們久等了。What? Counterfeit bills? Yeah, those have got to be fake. Unbelievable. I mean, it's fucking weird, right? Where'd all that extra money come from? He did have to go to the bank. No, he went to the second floor. Never set foot outside. Mm -hmm. I saw him. And when he came back down, he was carrying the case of money. Could be they've got a safe up there. 
Who knows how much would be in it? But then why not move a sufficient amount from there to here? Why did I come up short? There's always the explanation that someone was just lazy. If all he needed to do was go up to another safe, he wouldn't have asked for half an hour. Good point. Let me get this straight. When the vendor asked for payment, there wasn't enough cash. So then the boss got more money from... somewhere in this building. And that's where the box comes in, remember? Ah, yes. There was a box with paper in it, next to the uh, ones with shark fins and abalone and stuff. Yeah. So that's how they turn a profit, is they're not really paper. giving them money. Before he paid the guy, the foreman took that paper up to the second floor. Wait, are you saying the paper is... It's what they use to print the fake money. They make that shit right there. You think they have that kind of printer? They've gotta. What, and all the stuff they're importing, they just buy it with their fake-ass money? I don't know. Seems like a damn foolish plan. True, but, but if they're possible. super... They do make all their payments up front with cash. Yeah. That's really unusual in this day and age, especially with the sales volume they have. Another good point. There has to be some reason why they would refuse to use a bank. Because it's and big I money. think their big profits tell the same story. But you would think you would think that eventually the guys they're selling to would catch on and be like, wait a minute, this is fake money. What the fuck? You, you think, but who knows? Maybe it sounds believable to you two. Not to me. But it's right there. The reason they pay in cash is to use their fake money. Can't do that with a bank. That would also explain why they're able to sell at cost. The profits would be crazy doing it this way. I mean, after all, they're essentially getting their product for free. Plus, the seller takes the fake bills to China, where they won't be traced back to Japan. Ah, uh, okay. It's bold. But in a way, airtight. Mabuchi's a sharp guy. True, but again, I, I, I would assume the, the, the people that they are buying the products from, unless they give that money, like, they're not giving them the money that to the people that come there. Like, that's not their money. They give it to the people they get when they're back in China. You would think they'd be like, wait a fucking second. This came from here. So it's like... Maybe his primary goal is to hide where the money comes from. What do you mean... Money laundering. Or that, yeah, I forgot when about I money prison, laundering. I heard some guys in my room talking. They said foreign currency is easier to fake than yen. But the problem was, you have no way of turning that fake money into yen. If you take it to the bank, they'll know it's fake right away. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's why Mabuchi is laundering the shit with a cash-only trading company. The products are just a front for the money laundering. Sounds like we have a lead on Mabuchi's fraudulent scheme. Let's use this to threaten him. We've got leverage now. Wait, this is all just speculation. Yeah, that's true. It's so all speculation. Far. No we actual need to find proof. solid proof that he's counterfeiting money. Proof that will really force his hand. What if we snuck up to the second floor and took a picture of the money printer? No way would it be that easy. If they have a printer up there, security on that floor will be tight as hell. And if we get caught, it won't just be a slap on the wrist. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, let's not do anything super dangerous. We only need to sneak out one fake bill. Psycho, you already have access to the fake money. Uh, yeah, but didn't I tell you about the body check they do on me when I leave? Now I see why. They're doing that to ensure I don't take any of the fakes. Mm hmm Okay, but they don't check us guys. We're just unloading crates. Could you slip us a bill while we're working? I could try. You have to be really careful. Of course. Nice. Tomorrow I can say goodbye to all this manual labor. I'm actually feeling kind of excited about this plan. Mm, just then hope it doesn't blow up in our faces. Then dinner tonight. <laughs> we'll all need our energy. Nanchan, we're going shopping again. Me again? I'm beat. No worries. I'll go. Okay. Ichiban, you used to be a Yakuza, right? Uh, yeah. Your old life must have been a scary one. Was it hard on you? I guess so. But what counts as scary is different for everyone, isn't it? And, you know, it changes over time and all that. Yeah. True. I understand. I'll tell you something. 
The old me would have no idea what to do in this situation. But the new me? It feels like she can do anything. What about the old you, huh? Or at the very least, what used to scare her just doesn't anymore. Sounds great. But you still gotta remember what actually is dangerous and be careful. You worry too much. Come on, let's go. <sighs> okay. Hobos just turn around. They're like, Whoa. Now, do I actually have to go shopping or is this kind of like another one of those skipping cutscenes? It looks like it's another skipping cutscene. Not a skipping cutscene, but it's like a fade to black next day type thing like it was prior. Yep, here we go. Okay. Where is this hello work? Okay, I want to find the confectionist. Uh, we'll check this out. We'll check that out. Um, oh, it's all the way up there. Actually, sweet. Okay. Uh, let's actually check out the sub story. Maybe it could wrap up. And then we can check out maybe that other sub story that's up there after we check out Ichiban Confections. Oh, what the Oh, I think that's the guy we could hire for work. Cool. I like her in the idol outfit. I don't know why it's very fitting for her. Let's not recruit yet. I, I don't I don't wanna focus on recruiting people until it's like, yeah, we're in a good spot, cuz <laughs> Kazuki-san, I was waiting for you. Look at this. Now I can buy some clothes. Great job. This probably won't get you more than like a shoe. Singular. Uh, no way. How much do you think I'll need? Hmm. Well, if you go with something on the cheap, you might be able to scrape by. Oh. That low end shit ain't gotten exactly win you any points. Oh, Terracotta-san. Wait, how do you you know? As if it was a big secret. It's plain as the nose on your face. And boy, tell me, let me tell you, your nose is pretty plain. Anyway, never mind that. I came to give you this. <gasps> it's from me and the other boys. Watching you out there and earn like that it was hard not to root for you. Terracotta son. Good luck out there. Arigatou yes, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Right on. Let's go get you some new threads. Okay. I hope this is just a simple, we buy the clothes and then we're like right back there to like see the end of this sub story. This one's a sub story that really takes you all over the place. Same with the one with the, the gift one from that, the hobo, the homeless guy to the uh, little boy. Now that I say it like that, it sounds a little weird. <laughs> Yeah, not bad. You know, I was kind of giving him an old voice, but he's... Honestly, he's not that old. So I'll, maybe I'll give him a different voice. What do you think? <clears throat> hey, not bad. You're like a whole new man. I'm so relieved. I should show Shirakawa-san. I love this music that they plays. You know, the triumphant... dun 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 dun, dun. Ba -da -ba -da -da. Just so happens it's a soup kitchen day. Perfect timing. Let's go. Hello. Sir Kawasan. Oh, Kori-san! <laughs> wow, look at you! You look amazing! 
Oh, uh, thank you. It's not voice, so it's not the end of the sub story yet. Congratulations <laughs> like that, I said we didn't do half bad. You now this changes how others see him a bit. Keep at it, Corio. Corio. Nope, still not done with it, huh? I close my eye. Oh, guess we could just do it right now. Oh, Kazuka-san, thank you so much for last time. <laughs> no worries, looks like you two really hit off. Happy for you. Yes, on that note, I had something I wanted to discuss with you, Kazuka-san. I know it might be a bit early, but I was thinking of asking Sarakawa-san out on a date. No any good places for a date? Having no experience, I'm not really sure where to take her. I think you two understand he's acting a hell of a lot more positive than he used to. So that's good at least. Mm. First date, huh? Okay. The hotel, the house, the theater. Honestly, <sighs> never take someone out to a theater on the first date because it's the first date. You need to get to know them. I'd say a movie is a good third or fourth date. You you want to maybe a second date depending on how the first date goes, but you it, all, it also depends on who you who you went out with. Like my my one girlfriend I had uh, kind of technically our first date was a theater, you could say, but I, she was someone that I kind of knew a while and we talked for quite a bit before I actually said like, hey, let's go on the date type thing. So it's someone like, I kind of like knew a lot about, not a lot, but I like, I knew enough that's like, okay, we could just go and hang out and not say anything. A first date should always, like a first date with someone who you're not too familiar with should always be like, let's go get dinner or something, you know, have dinner, some conversation, you know, learn like, oh, so what do you do for a living? Oh, this is what I do. Uh, you know, learn some basic stuff. That's a good first date. And if you learn enough during your first date, then the second date could be a movie or it could be another one. It's like, hey, let's go get dinner again. Or, hey, let's just go get a cup of coffee or something like that. It all depends. It all depends. But for someone, may, uh, for someone like this, I wouldn't say let's go yeah. to the theater. So you're going to the movies. I guess you can talk about it afterwards. See what you both thought. I guess that could be another thing, too, is, like, you could go to a movie and then maybe go to, like, a small cafe afterwards to kind of, like, talk about the movie or talk about other things. Again, it's all perspective, I'd say. See, yeah, I'll definitely keep the conversation going. Thank you, Kazuka-san. Well, yeah, and since it's a date, you guys should go see one of those romantic flicks. Romantic? Okay, I understand. I'll go and ask her out right away. Oh, does she have an eye patch on? Oh, so is on. Oh, your face. Are you all right? <gasps> oh, Koi-san, I'm fine. I just uh bumped into something. That's all. Pork soup coming right up. Yeah. Oh well, I. Wait, no. Yes, thank you. But actually, I have something I want to ask you. Uh -huh. Oh, what is it? I, know. I feel like that's not the actual thing. She didn't bump into something. I feel like something else happened. Um, would you like to go to the movies with me? What? Is that a no? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just surprised. It's definitely not a no. <laughs> You've changed, cory san You're totally different from when I first met you. I think so? Hi. Yes, I could le le learn a thing or two from you. I'll be looking forward to the movie. This is a long ass sub story. Damn, that went well. <laughs> the ghost on said, yes, we're meeting at sea Seagull Cinema around noon. Right, I was thinking of getting her a gift for our date, but I wanted to ask for your advice again. No. No, you don't need me anymore, man. Huh? You know her better than I do at this point. I'm sure you'll come up with something. Flowers, man. Just keep doing what you're doing. Didn't she say she liked a specific kind of flower? I can't remember what. Oh! I guess I do know her a little better now. Yeah, okay. I mean, it's Seagull Cinema. Okay. Uh, I want to check out Ichiban Confections first. Maybe start that one sub story that's close by it. Cousin. 
Kasan. It's finally time. Your first shareholder meeting. Hmm? Shareholder what now? Hmm. In short, it's a meet and greet with the shareholders, those who have stock in our company. Shareholders are going to throw questions and opinions your, our way based on the results of the financial term. So I'd like you to do your best to deal with them, Kazuka-san. Deal with them? Well, it's actually more akin to qu quarreling their anger. Our company still has a long way to go, so of course our shareholders are always angry in one way or another. But if they go home angry, they'll start forging their sales, and the value of a share will drop considerably. If the share price goes, the value of the company goes with it. <sighs> the share price ranking goes to shit, it'll be hard to fulfill the promise of Nick. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Yes, that's exactly right. Seriously? You say it's a meet and greet, but it doesn't sound fun at all. Okay, so what do I gotta do to make them less angry? The best way to do that is to demonstrate the charm of our company and properly address the opinions of our shareholder. That should be enough to leave them satisfied. <laughs> if not, you can try apologizing from the bottom of your heart. Groveling might be a good way to go, too. I've done it a few times, and it's proved more effective. Sounds like you've had it rough, but wait. Am I doing this by myself? I'm not sure if it's just me. I'm not sure if it's just me being enough to convince these guys. Oh, no, you won't be by yourself. You'll be able to choose up to four employees to join you at the shareholder meeting. So please make sure you have a strong team lined up beforehand. Each employee has a different level of persuasion ability along with a specific field of expertise. So keep these in mind as you choose your team. Also, I should tell you it's better to bring employees with higher positions and motivation to the shareholder meetings. They tend to make more per they tend to be much more persuasive. Wow. I got you. Okay, then. I'll get a good team together and drive right in. Dive right yes. in. Yes. Great. Please do, Kazuki-san. Oh, well, duh. Om Omelette has to be on that always. I mean, Omelette has the biggest thing ever. Managed properties can now be accessed. Managed boys can now be accessed. Boardrooms can now be accessed. Oh, so she's at her cap with level five, but if I... I could promote her. Doesn't look like anything is done, but I might as well do sure it. Know how to treat your elders. No, honestly, I probably should have saved before I did this. I think I'll wait to buy a uh, more. I think I'll wait to buy more properties until I actually have more employees. In preparation for shareholder means, you can check the current status of the company as well as at which members will be participating in shareholder means. Current approval rating, the approval rating of the shareholders that affect the financial reporting during the shareholder means. Net worth, total of a company and borrowed funds. Managed employees, the number of current employees and their conditions. Current period sales to date. The accumulation sales to date of the current period. Pay next meeting. Information on the shareholding scheduled to be attended at the next shareholders meetings. Attend meeting. Check and edit employees scheduled attend to shareholders meetings. Okay. 
Hooverain will be bad, but the good is up. Current approval rating is at 50%. Could I maybe recruit one employee? Let me look at the properties. Okay, I'll definitely need someone who's more on the product side. So maybe I'll buy someone who's a good product member. And it'd be her. No, no, not her, her. I honestly should have probably saved first. Let's do this. Consider the shareholders handled. Skills cancel confirm. Show of means we'll t see you take on a real time QA battle as you attempt to quarrel angry shareholders by answering that onslaught of questions. Within the time allowed, you will do all you can to unleash your employees' counter arguments against shareholders. Critique, keeping them happy and most importantly quiet. Should you fail to please the shareholders, the value of the company stocks will decrease, pushing you further away from the top spot of the shareholders ranking. Should you succeed, however, the value of the stocks will increase. Shareholders are essential to your company's growth. So get ready to kick as and maybe even kiss some corporate ass. Part of the QA battle, financial report will be released. Your standing with the shareholders will de de depend on how well you do have done with both your ranking and management index. The speed of command power recovery will depend on the conditions of participating in place. Good means faster recovery and bad means slower recovery. QA battle starts when the players select the shareholders to ask their first qu their question. Fail to select someone quick enough and the shareholders' irritation gauge will begin to fill. Once completely filled, Gabe will start voicing their opinions whether you select them or not. Your employees will have a chance to attack by refuting the shareholders' opinions by using command power and given orders, your employees will make remarks about your company. Your command power will fill up slowly over time. You will only have a small window of time to refuse the shareholders' opinions, but should you succeed, you will deal damage to the shareholders. Failure, however, and your employees will take damage. Reducing the shareholders' spirit to zero will, rele will leave them fully convinced the company is in good hands, resulting in their defeat. Once an employee's spirit hits zero, they will no longer be able to speak up at the meeting and therefore be unable to fight. Win condition. Convince all shareholders within the time given. Have an approval rating of 50% or more at the end of the bout. Fulfill either of the two conditions above to win. Lose conditions. All employees are unable to fight. Approval rating hits 0%. Approval rating at the end of the bout is below 50. You will lose if you meet any of these conditions above. In addition to giving commands, you will be a you'll have a variety of skills at your disposal. Skills can range from level 1 to level 3 and become accessible on the passing of time and through actions taken in battle. Counterattacks. You can refute a shareholder's critique through your employee's counterattack, uh, counterarguments. The number of counterarguments required to refute a critique changes depending on their affinity. When you successfully refute a uh, critique, a counter change will, chance will occur. During this period, shareholder's guard is, guard is lowered, allowing you to deal damage directly. Your share price and share price ranking are affected by the outcome of the shareholder's being. 
results, the more expense, experience points your employees will gain. Because I guess compensation will increase as well. We'll start with the financial report. President Kasuga, if you would. We'll kick things off with the financial report. Thank you. Let's move on to the Q&A. If you have any questions... Hey, you can you can あまりうまくいってないですね。このままではダメになります。Please raise your hand if you have a question. Give him a light heart apology, deal light damage to all shareholders. How about any damage to all shareholders prevent all actions for a short period of time? So he covers Japan's fine spirit. Have any questions? This is the time to ask. Meeting. <laughs> okay. Well, everybody, this calls for a celebration. Thanks, everybody. Thank you. Okay. Great. Shares are skyrocketing. Ooh. My ranking had better be go gone up a, quite a bit. That's what I'm talking about. Our ranking went up. Nice. That's a good ranking. The results from the Cheryl means I've earned you the next ex executive award. Wait, is that actually money that I get? Well, we'll see. Bum bum ba 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 da 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 da. Come on, little loading bar. I see you. Go 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 go. <laughs> oh, my. Great work today, President Kazuga. <sighs> Beat. Sure, the means are rough. You'll get used to it. The more our company grows, the bigger the number of shareholders and more extreme the claims. Today's meeting was just the beginning. Really? That said, I think you did great for your first time. Convincing all the shareholders that the meeting can have an overwhelming positive effect at our share value. Perhaps it's best to think of it as a shareholder meeting as though it were a sporting event. Just as you would do all you can to prepare for a big game, it's best to run the business while always ex anticipating the upcoming shareholder meeting. <laughs> right. Run a strong, great for anything business, but one that won't anger the shareholders too much. Still, this sounds pretty tough, so I'll be looking for you for support. Yes. Of course, by all means. Please keep up the good work, President Kazuga. Looks like she's trying to say something. Oh, it looks like she's in a good mood today. Okay. Kazuka-san, would you like to return to managing business? 
Yes. Understood. Please continue to look after Ichiban Confections. Let's get down to business. Debts can now be accessed. You can finance your business through banks, money lenders, and cash advances. Interest and the number of scheduled payments will differ depending on whom you borrow from. So it's best to consider your situation before you decide. Should you have the funds to make a lump sum payment, you can select the lender from debt and pay off your loan in one fell swoop, okay? Okay. Okay, let me look at all these. You're more of an of an expertise person down there. You're a lover and you're kind of the other two. If I can get them both and get one more business, I think I'd be good. You know what? How about I do this? I'm going to save, and then I'll do that. And if I feel like that wasn't a good thing to do, I'll reload this. Let's get down to business. Well, I can't even buy that. Okay, let me... and love okay or services whatever that thing's called okay we're not going to meet it so like that's the problem we'll meet the love for this one but she's going right from a looser spot of where she's currently at plus she's the leader a way I could just level them up.
can't make this one because I don't have enough funds. But I think we'll be okay. We got Let's a do job it. to do. Oh, I think that was actually way better than projected. These are incredible nice. results. You guys did great out there. Those are going up. Ah, oh, we didn't move up. Okay. There's an account to get. There's a commercial time slot available this period. A well thought out commercial would provide a huge boost to our sales. Don't have enough money. I can't really do that. Uh, can I upgrade the properties? Oh, that's a sell. Oh, well, I'm not selling that. Uh, Upgrading some of these, one of these employees, maybe. We got a job to do. I don't think that was as much as we would have gotten. These are incredible nice. results. You guys did great out there. Those are going up. Other retail shops in Okama are currently holding the double point promotion. Sales from these businesses are forecast to go up. We can expect some profit this period. Contacted by employee MC, there are some candidates looking to work for our company. He has good of uh, that, you know what, yeah. I could maybe let one go and put him in. We 
can still reach the spot with him there, but... Got a job to do. Let's make it again. <laughs> Pretty lucky. I can still make it. Work. Here's how the business did. Are incredible nice. results. You guys did great out there. We're going up. Okay. That don't sound legit. Why haven't I? My guess is I'm going to end up having to reload that one save. Because I don't think I'll be able to get there as much. Maybe... The good news is, the one dude actually likes this a lot, but the two, the middle and the first guy, don't really like this much. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna actually just fire that dude. I don't know why I even. I don't care. Yeah, I don't know why I had him hired. We got a job to do. 
This might be something I just might reload, and I'll probably not. I'll probably do the majority of this off screen, but let's. Let's make it. Yes. hate me now, but... Oh. Okay. Consider the shareholders... Alright, let's do this shareholders meeting. Okay, so I guess... We'll start with the financial report. President Kasuga, if you would. Kick things off with the financial report. Okay, I'm at 65 percent. Let's move on to the Q and A. Hey, okay, so stay with us, guys. Yeah, we're just done. Hey, Jinga, see you later. ま、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、ちょっと、
なこともありますよね。ラッキー。はい、決めないと。Don't have enough money. I don't have enough money. We're all good from now. We got a job to do. Lucky, lucky. That's not right. Lucky, lucky. That's not right. I can still make it win. Here's how the business did. These are incredible results. We're going up. I'm gonna invest in Grandma again. Our ranking went up. Nice ranking went up. Appeared on TV. We see. Whoa! Wow. How's that amount need to recruit employees that decreased significantly? Okay. The thing is, I can't buy more properties. I could buy properties. Okay. I think your husband material. There's always room to grow. There we go. I forgot that I could upgrade the facilities. Kind of forgot about that. Let's make that again. Pretty lucky. Yes. Lucky. I can still make it. Yes. 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 Nice. You guys did great out there. This is going up. The up soon. Um. Yeah. 
Good. We got a job to do. So 611 is what we're projected. Let's see what we get. Yes. Lucky. Lucky. I can still make it. <laughs> I think we just barely got that much. Ah, we were a little shy of it, but that's fine. Nice. You guys did great out there. Things are going up. That's the good shit. Our ranking went up. Ranking went up one more again. Okay, good. Maybe the shareholder. Maybe the shareholders meeting. No. The shareholders meeting is about to begin. Just as long as everyone is like happy. I think I don't I think I should like not worry about employees until I have Consider the I think I should hold off on buying employees until I actually have another business. We'll kick things off with the financial Thank you. Let's move on to the Q&A. If you have any questions, this is the time. Respect your elders. Please raise your hand if you have a question. Please raise your hand if you have a question. Please raise your hand if you have a question. Please raise your hand if you have a question. Please raise your hand if you have a question. If you have any questions, I'm just gonna this let it build up. Respect your elders. Please raise your hand if you have any questions. Please raise your hand if you have any questions. Okay, I think I understand somewhat. Now, just a minute. Okay, I think I need to find a red employee. I have two financials. Okay, okay, I'm understanding those little circles there. Right, I think we'll be done after this. The meeting was great. Orders are skyrocketing. Keep it up. Our ranking went up. Ah, close to there.
Yeah, see? Okay, so I, I have too many green people, so I, I'll need, like... So I need to, like, get some red people. But I, again, I... It's one of those things I can't really do until after, so how about I swap... There we go. Like, that'd be helpful. That'll be helpful. With the manage employees one. Okay. Well, that's gonna do it, guys. Okay, everyone. That's gonna do it for this part of Let's Play Yakuza Like a Dragon. I think I'm gonna focus more so on this off-screen. Uh, but let me know. Let me know if you guys want me to do that or not. Uh, but anyway, guys, in the next part, we will do story. More so than anything. So anyway... Thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you like the video, please give that like button a click. Comment down below what you guys like about the video, didn't like about the video. Let me know what you guys think of this, uh, what do you guys think of this, uh, the business thing aspect. I honestly, I like it so far. It's uh, very good. I know I said we were going to start this, uh, sub story, but obviously, let's not. Let's, let's actually focus more so on story in the next part, or I'll actually go, um, uh, Maybe I will. Actually, can I can I actually end up going? I'm you know what? Yeah, I'll actually go up this way to Um I'll go this Oh, I actually can't. They don't let me. Okay. So, oh, I can go up this way though. Haha. So let's just go up here, check out this sub story. Check out the update of that substory. Maybe is there if there's a way I can get over there from here, maybe I will. We'll see. But anyway, guys, that's gonna do it. Uh so yeah, let me know what you guys think about the business. And as always, guys, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a beat and subscribe to the main channel too. That's in the description below. As well as follow me on Twitter, both my main Twitter, the RG Kim Kid Twitter are in there too. Thank you all so much for watching once again. I'll see you all next time.